figured out from your call, this is about what is still being referred to as Claudia's disappearance, which we both know is... I want you to arrest me for Claudia's murder. so as opposed to Sam had plans no, because to tell you about with me I was supposed to spend the evening with her I get to her apartment the jacuzzi's on the candles are lit but Sam's not there all right any sign of forced entry no, no. struggle no maybe she just got called away no, she, would, she would have called me maybe she she didn't have time Look, I don't have time to go around and around lucky I know what I know I'm asking you please will, will you help me Jason why do you want me to arrest you do you know Franco yeah, I went to a show at the Proet Gallery. His, his thing is crime. No, his, his thing is, is death. He's obsessed with it, and now he's obsessed with me. What are you talking about? Look, it's such a long story. I... Condensed version. Franco didn't come to Port Charles to do an art show. He came to meet me. He, he, he was following me for weeks before anyone knew that he was in town. Look, I... I know that I know that this sounds crazy, but it's true. He thinks that we're alike, and at first he wanted us to work together. Now he wants to prove that he's better than me. You're right, that does sound I've, crazy. I've tried to ignore Franco, but he's not having it. He keeps raising the stakes. Do you know that he approached Carly at the Christmas tree lot with, with, with uh, Jocelyn? Did he threaten them? No, he, no, he's too smart for that. I mean, Carly didn't even know who the guy was, but the next day, I get a package with Jocelyn's hat inside. Another message to yeah, And now Sam's disappeared. Franco has her. I know it. Well, it could appear that way. I've had my suspicions about Franco. I've, we've sort of been tracking him. What, how? Well, the way Joey Limbo's body was posed. There was a photograph of Franco's exhibit that matched the crime scene a little too closely to be written off as a coincidence. All right, look, let's just say that I believe everything you just said. And Franco did grab Sam. Right. How does arresting you get her back? Love the flare. I wish we had more time to do some more setups. What's the hurry? <laughs> well, I have another project. Is it inappropriate to say that it might be my masterpiece? I know, pretentious, not to say premature, given I haven't produced anything yet, but you are a start. So this is an art project? Absolutely. I'm calling it Bait Part One. For Jason. All I asked was a little recognition. Give me some love and I'll leave town without a trace. But he refused, so now he has to choose. Choose what? It's a good question. Who besides you? I'm the only bait you need. No, need two. Can't choose between one. I don't get it. Why are you going to make Jason choose it all? If he's disrespected you so much, the hell with him. Yeah. Well, you know, I could flip a coin. What do you suppose I've done with my lucky quarter? been a step ahead of me from the beginning which means he's had all the power and I gotta find some way to gain the advantage I gotta throw something at Franco that he doesn't expect and if I'm locked up for Claudia's murder Sam does him no good and he's just gonna let her go just like that that's not the impression I get of this guy lucky I have no I have no idea what to do anymore I gotta do something if he thinks I'm off the streets maybe he'll let his guard down and show himself look I haven't I have no right to ask you to put your job on the line. But you want me to make a big flashy scene, bringing you in, 
and then let you slip out the back door. Is that Franco, it? Franco wouldn't see it coming. Please. That's all I've got. The Mayor Floyd has been riding my ass about wrapping up Claudia's case. You know what? I'm about to make his day. Can't the mayor hold his self-serving press conference in his own office? He says there's no space. Oh, good point. His big inflated ego will suck up all the room. <laughs> Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? Thank you. I've asked you here to make a major announcement. This is a day the good citizens of Port Charles have anticipated in vain for far too long. The day where I make good on my pledge to restore law, and order, and yes, civility to the streets of our fair city. Jason Morgan, number one enforcer for the Corinthos organization, a cold-blooded killer who has thus far eluded prosecution, is finally going to be made to answer for his crimes, at least one of them. Jason Morgan has just been arrested for the murder of Claudia Corinthos. And here they come. Ladies and gentlemen, Detective Lucky Spencer. Grateful City offers you its thanks. Nice work, Detective. They're so cute at this age. has terrorized this city for years, but today his reign ends as a direct result of the policies I put in place. I promised the citizens of Port Charles a victory over organized crime, and I delivered. Thank you for coming. That's all, ladies and gentlemen. I always count on Mayor Floyd to be as predictable as night falls day. Mayor Floyd has an ego. Yeah, well, it works for us. This bloated ego played right into our hands. Floyd didn't even bother making sure you had, in fact, been arrested. He just called a press conference and so he could break his own arm, patting himself on the back. That speech, it's gonna get major media. Everyone will think you're in jail, and I didn't even have to lie. Or file a false arrest report. Look, I don't want this coming back on you. How is it my fault if the mayor's office jumped the gun, you know? And besides, as much as I hate it, you managed to beat most of the charges brought against you anyway. So, it's just gonna look like more of the same. The bigger issue is that I have reason to believe that Sam's been abducted and I'm doing nothing about it. Please. Lucky, no cops. This guy is not afraid to kill. It's, it's just business to him. Okay. But you gotta keep me informed. And if there's anything I can do to help Sam get back safely, just let me know. with the police in this town. Why the hell are they arresting Jason Morgan? He hasn't killed anyone lately. At least not anyone worth remembering. And meanwhile, I'm kidnapping women right and left and no one cares. Help! 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 Now that we've got that out of the way. You know what? If you're trying to lure Jason here, it's not going to work. He's in jail. <laughs> yeah, pretty convenient if you ask me. Think he got himself arrested on purpose? You know, I'm sorry that Jason can't come play with you, but there's no sense in holding me. I'm sure there is. All we have to do is get him released. How do you plan on doing that? <laughs> me? You're his ticket to ride. I don't have any pull with the cops. <laughs> well, underestimate yourself. All you have to do is tell him that Jason didn't kill Sonny's wife. That it was your son, Michael. No. No? No! No, he didn't do it. Or no, you won't say.
you're willing to let your best friend rot in jail to protect your son. Well, it's a good thing for Jason I'm not giving you the choice. What are you gonna do? Me? I'm gonna curl up in bed, pull the covers over my head, and refuse to come out. You feeling neglected, you poor baby. Ah, humble artist in town, to meet his equal. No malice in my heart. I'm just out for glory. I reached out to Jason, and he bit the hand that would gladly feed him. What does this have to do with my son? Sonny Jr. is a means to an end, as are you. Okay, I'll help you. Michael doesn't have to be a part of this. No, you had your chance. Fortunately, I don't need you. Lottie's body is my whole card, so to speak. Well, that only proves that she's dead. Uh, well, not if you add the photos I have of Michael kneeling over the corpse he bashed straight to hell. More than enough for even the inept PCPD to let Jason go. Okay, all right. What if I can get him out another way? What if I can get him out of an another way? Michael doesn't have to be a part of this. <laughs> Who do I have to screw to get off this movie? I can make this happen. Right. Okay. So, I just let you go, and then you go down to the police station, and then, presto, Morgan the Magnificent is on his way. Jason is going to find you. You're damn right he will. And when he does... Hello.